Welcome back to Open House NYC. Today we are all about Brooklyn living. Now we're taking you to the waterfront loft of Winka Doubledom, one of the leading figures of modern architecture today and the founder of Architectonics. The firm is known for going against the grain, for creating unique, innovative and sustainable designs that always surprise. Hi, I'm Winke Doeldam, a Dutch architect with offices in uh, New York and in Holland, and uh, this is Snooze. For a lot of architects, I think their house is kind of their business card. I'm the opposite. For me, my house is where I experiment, where I figure things out, where I try funny things, where I'm more daring. This apartment, I walked in and I fell madly in love with it and it's partially of this amazing view. The weird thing was that the living room was 70% kitchen dining and then 30% living and I live a lot. <laughs> I didn't think that was my lifestyle so I decided to put the whole seating area right in front of the view, have my fireplace in front of me so I could have nice fires. And it's very un-New York, it's almost, I feel like sometimes in a little bit back in Rotterdam because I have the big harbor cranes out there and this big ships coming by. And I'm really happy that now the kitchen is kind of this very fluid, very integrated uh, element that it combines carbon fiber with the yellow glass counter. It's totally suspended, so it has, takes no volume, it takes no weight. This kind of insanely large top cabinet that is just one door that lifts like it's a feather. And I decided to put the fridge as a long band in one wall and then hide all the ovens in the microwaves as a long band in another wall. So it's a bit atypical and that comes back to the architect being an experiment for themselves. Are you comfortable? You're just having a moment of meditation. Ah, baby. And for the living room, I chose a lot of Moroso pieces that are, I guess they're again, sort of suspended and floating. I think that all of them are kind of little characters in a way. They have their own uh, idiosyncrasies and, uh, and, and strange uh, behavior stripes with ear flaps. And I started to get a little bit away from black with this carpet where I added colors and the purple table. So I tend to not believe so much in style, but much more in character and identity. I guess when, uh, when I go into uh, the bedroom design, I love my big walk-in closet with mirrory doors, little lights in it so at night it can sort of shimmer. I chose a wallpaper in basically the same pattern but two different colors. So there's a silver side and then there is a purplish dark gray side. I tend to like kind of interesting little things that you don't expect. I have to say this house has become a sanctuary. Having an absolutely insane lifestyle, traveling everywhere. I have to say the best hotel room is still this hotel room. <laughs> <laughs>